What's up guys? Just hanging out at the house. I had to work today, so I'm just chilling out now. I figured I'd go ahead and do the other part of this review for you guys while I'm just hanging out. So I hope y'all are having a good weekend. Like I said I had to work. But it is beautiful outside today, but I'm in hanging out in the house watching TV. Actually, I'm watching this new channel on YouTube that I've been checking out, Beard Nerd Reviews. He's a good guy. I've talked to him a couple of times, so go check out Beard Nerd Reviews. Some good stuff. So, guys, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Hit the like button. Share the video with everybody. And make sure you hit that notification button. So, like I said, this is the second part of the original Lumberjack review. Like I said, they sent me so much stuff, which I really appreciate, that I had to split it up. So, this is the other part of that review. So, first of all, they sent me these cool-ass stickers. I think these are the biggest... It's one of the biggest stickers I've gotten from a company. But it's really cool. Thank you, Original Lumberjack, for that. I love stickers. So this will add right to my collection. And they sent me a couple of their business cards. Which this is the front. And they are located in Vancouver, Washington. And Andrea... L. Harvey is the owner. I hope I said that name right. If I didn't, I apologize. So I want to thank Andrea for sending me over all these great products. I really appreciate it. I really have enjoyed them. And got their email and website. Maybe you guys can see that in the screenshot it. So now that we got that out of the way, the, before I get to products, guys, I want to um, do a review on the beard brush they sent me. They sent me an original Lumberjack beard brush. That's on you. It's really nice wood. And here's the bristles. They are a softer bristle than I usually use, but they're not real soft. They do still have a little stiff stiffness to them and most beer brushes I don't know if you can see that most beer brushes go like this like a concave this one goes over if you can see it's really nice and it's a bigger than most beard brushes that I've used are and I've been using this a lot brush right through it don't get real deep into my beard because it's getting longer and thicker now but it does do a good job I really like this brush. So the brush definitely gets two thumbs up and ten star rating. So thank you for the beard brush. I have, just like the other one, I had two oils and four bombs for you guys. So let's just jump right into it. The first oil I have is a spice oil. Which, as I mentioned before, all the oils have the same carriers, which are almond oil, sunflower oil, jojoba oil, aloe oil, vitamin E, and your essential oils. So it is in the brown amber bottle. This is their label. And it has your typical dropper. It does have a little yellow tint to it, but not very much. Now, like I said on the other video, it is a thicker oil. They do not have the essential oils on here. But if you guys have ever used like a spicy, a spiced citrus, um, oil that's what it smells like without the citrus 
just a sp nice spicy oil. But it does really smell nice, y'all. Yeah, it definitely smell a little bit of clove to me, it smells like. And maybe some other kind of spice, I'm not sure. But it does, it smells nice, guys. And like I said, these oils, they absorb really well. Um, no beer drift with them. It didn't make my beard feel greasy. Anything like that. It did put a, a slight shine on my beard, but not overly shiny. So, um, that was the spice oil, which I really enjoy it. I also give it two thumbs up and ten stars. Um, they also sent me two bombs for the spice, which... All the bombs are two ounce bombs. I'm not sure of the price on them, but they are two ounces. And like I said, yes, in the other video, they do call it beer grease and not beer bombs. And it does have raw shea butter, coconut oil, beeswax, tea tree oil, vitamin E, and then other natural oils and the wax. This, this right here is the original compound. Which is like more on your less a medium hold, so it don't make your beard real stiff. And it smells exactly like the oil got that spicy smell. Yeah, I definitely smell some clothes in there, but it does smell really nice, guys. And then they sent me. The rugged hold for the spice as well, which are they are all twist off lids. So whether that matters to you guys or not, I really don't care anymore. And like I said, exactly the same. And this, I haven't used the um, rugged hold for spice yet, but I do plan on it. But like I said in the other video, most of the time I like a medium whole bomb. That way my beard don't feel all really stiff. But on occasion when I go out, like to dinner or something, I would want a stronger holding bomb. Or if the wind's blowing real bad during the day. And that's what I would use the stronger hold for. Because the stronger hold is going to weigh your beard down more. Because it has more beeswax in it to hold. That's how you get that extra hold. So it is a little heavier bomb. The rugged hold is. But I, I enjoy it. Sometimes I like the heavier, the stiffer beard so it don't go everywhere. But it does. Both bombs really soften your beard up nice. It's smooth. Um, it goes in your beard smooth and melts down really nice. So for both of the spicy bombs, definitely 10 stars, 2 thumbs up. So we'll go on to the last oil I have for original Lumberjack. Which this one is called Black Tie. Now this one is my favorite between... The black tie and the spicy. I do like the black tie better, a little bit better than I do the spicy, but I still like the spicy. And like I said, all the carriers are the same, which are almond oil, sunflower oil, jojoba oil, aloe oil, vitamin E, and then your essential oils. So shake your oils up, and it's in your brown amber bottle just like the rest of them it's a little label and like all I do know that all the oils are ounce oils and they are $14.99 because they are on right you probably can't see but it's right there it tells you $14.99 but it's got your brown amber bottle and your typical dropper as you can see 
and this one it has the same yellow can color to it and it is like still a thicker oil which you guys know I love the thicker oil I will put this stuff in guys but I just today I'm just hanging out at the house so I just when I got home from work I took a shower and just put some butter in so I don't want to put nothing in right now but this one this just reminds me of a cologne just a nice crisp clean cool cologne like if you're going to get dressed up in a black tie a suit or something and go out and you throw some cologne on that's what this smells like to me they named it perfectly but yeah it smells great guys um this is one of my wife's favorites she does like this scent a lot i guess because it smells more like a cologne so since i've got this when we go out this is what she wants me to wear so it's always a plus when your wife likes the beard oil or bomb that you're using always a plus guys gotta make them women happy so 10 stars, two thumbs up for the black tie. I love it. It smells awesome. And they also sent me the beer grease, the original and the rugged for that too. Which, like I said, these all had the same thing. Raw shea butter, coconut oil, beeswax, tea tree oil, vitamin E, other natural oils, and the wax. Which, this is the original compound for that. Everything looks the same. Two ounce, ten. And you see, I've used it a little bit. And this one, I'll, I'll take some out so you guys can see how easy it is to get out. And it'll do a whole lot because I don't want to waste this stuff because I like it. And then you, right there, and then... Boom, gone. See, just smooth. No grit, no gritty feeling with none of their pro, none of their bombs. No clumps, nothing. Just smooth bomb. That smells amazing. It really does. See, you can, and you don't put the stuff in your beard. Rub it on your tattoos. Moisture, just moisturizes that skin. Moisturizes that skin. Brings them tattoos out. Yeah, that stuff smells good. Um, out of all their products, my two favorite oils and bombs out of their, these products they send me. The um, first one is definitely the whiskey tobacco. That one is awesome. I love it. And um, the second one would be this black tie. I really enjoy both of them. All their oils I love, but them are my two favorites. And like I said, they sent me the rugged hold to, and there's the back. And then, like I said, it's just got more beeswax in it, so you get a stronger hold. The original is a medium hold, and the rugged hold is a strong hold bomb. That's the only difference. They all smell the same and everything. As you can see, I have not used that. So... The stronghold is a little harder to get out because of the be more beeswax. And it is harder, a little bit harder to melt down, but it's still smooth and it, it don't take that long to melt down. So I would highly recommend this company on all the products that they sent me. I love all of them. And you guys should really check them out because they really got good products. If any... If you don't check out any of their other products, check out the whiskey tobacco. That stuff smells amazing. I really love that stuff. So make sure you go check out Original Lumberjack. And until next time, guys. Later.